Hello everyone, it's Anne from Anne's Papers Creations and I have a new project to share with you and uh, it's a lamp with uh, standing on some uh, suitcases and uh, the idea for this I uh, got from I had an old uh, lamp with a book stack and a lamp on the top and I also want to thank Annie as Miss Garden Girl for the inspiration she has made a book stack and uh, um, I know it's uh, Miranda from um, from uh, Miss Liberty who uh, did that first so uh, thank you both so I'll put the link to the uh, videos below or the channels so uh, maybe we can start on the top here uh, I had an old lamp that I took apart and uh, build it up again and made uh, I'm not sure what this is called Lampersheim in the Norwegian so and this is made uh, of uh, shipboard, thick shipboard and um, the way I did it I uh, can show you some here I cut out shipboard like this and then I cut around inside one half in and left one half of an inch and uh, this is for the side so uh, I will post uh, the picture of this and the measurements on my blog if you like to make it and uh, it is uh, about 22 inches high and uh, the largest suitcase is 11 inch and the smallest I think I went down one inch for each is 8 so, and it's uh, 11, 10, 9, and 8 inch. And I can also give you measurements up here about 9 inch high to here. So, uh, this, I really had a fun time making this, and uh, uh, not sure where to start here. Uh, I can start on the top. Here, I put on some laces around, and this I got from Annie's blog shop. And I will link to that as well below. She has a lot of beautiful laces and trims. And uh, here is a chain, and this I glued on. Here is another one, and this I think is a leather. I had it in my stash, and here is a pleated trim. And this chain here I sew on with a, I'm not sure I'm pronouncing it right, uh, with a needle and sewed it on. And uh, this is some uh, jute or twine. And uh, I didn't go around like so, I did uh, the opposite way, down and up. So I hope you can see the lighting inside, I can take it off. So I hope you see the difference. And uh, here is a stamp that I cut out. And it's the new stamps from Tim Holtz and I uh, cut it out so it's uh, dimensional and layered it. So I'm not sure you see it. And um, I made this so it would look really old uh, to go with uh, some other old things I have like camera and sewing machines and so. And this uh, is a lighter, like so. And um, here I painted the top in gold. I wanted to go it in top in uh, gold. This was silver. And I also went over with some rubbings of different uh, mediums. And uh, on the sides here I had some bottles. And these are also from Tim Holtz. Let's see if I can take them down. I will take my camera down and give you a more close-up look, I think. It's a bit hard to show it. Seems I'm make, making some high things lately. So it's difficult to film. So, this goes here. And here is a clock, and it's open, should be open, apparently, so. so this is hanging on the side. And, uh, this lamp was green and I painted it black. So. And uh, here for the suitcases I used the new uh, buckles from Tim Holtz, and these I painted black and also the new corners and this I had to cut apart so this will open so I will show you that later and this uh, here I used um, 
this is, I'm not sure what it's called, it's, I got it from Linda, so I laid it on and I used different uh, stains and inks and so, to get it an old look. And this one is uh, crackle painted, and um, this one was some old paper I crumbled up, and uh, it was packaging paper that when you order some stuff, they put in some paper to fill up, so I used it here. With, uh, glued it down with a uh, multi mat, and uh, the bottom here, here I use some um, uh, mediums. Uh, what is called uh, forming medi uh, medium, so it gets a bit bumpy. <laughs> yeah, and uh, for the handles here, I uh, used uh, crunch board, and uh, for these here, I used uh, the leather, and uh, this is uh, from the packaging from the grunge board from Tim Holtz. I uh, saved them, so I used them here. And here I am. Uh, uh, it's a key from Tim Holtz and um, I used to um, uh, show you. I showed it in the previous video also, but I can show you here. So uh, this is patina and uh, then you get it uh, grunged up and yeah, I forgot the word now, <laughs> but it corrugates so it looks old. So I got this three from Linda and they, they uh, together they make the look. So thank you so much Linda. Really appreciate this. So um, I think I can open um, here and show you a bit. So in each uh, here there are different things and I will show you what's inside this and this today. And I have some tags here and a mini album in this and I will make uh, separate parts for that so the video won't be too long. So this should open like so. So that's why I had to cut this apart so this will go up like so. So I think I will flip my camera down and uh, show you what's inside. But maybe first to give you an over uh, vibe here so I take my camera and show you a bit and um, yeah so I hope I don't make you so dizzy I'm not any good at filming by hand so I'll give you a close up here so and I haven't glued this down so this can be taken apart from the sides. So I can maybe take up off the top and show you how it looks like. So here you can see each of them. Like so. And so. So here you can see how it looks on the top. I put on some wire here and twined around some rope to get it hang on this one. So now for the drawer inside. So in this uh, first one here I put some... Um, take it a bit closer I think. Here are some uh, pencils. I took some paper around here and here I took some twine around. And here is a ruler from Tim Holtz. So and the paper sharper. I also grunged up a bit. And some clips here. All you need for writing here. So and here's a I'm not sure what this is called either, but uh, if you write something wrong. So this goes in the first drawer. So now I will show you the other one here. It's a sort of a shadow box. So meaning is to, to pull this out when the, uh, they are uh, all together, but it's a bit hard to film and show that. So, 
here is um, some different room inside and I'm not sure I, I told but all this is made from shipboard so and here it says enjoy the journey and it's a Tim Holtz stamp and here are some some hinges and uh, it opens with this it's also a new one from Tim Holtz I forgot the name on this <laughs> so here I have some bits and pieces inside so we can start here I have an old camera and a frame and uh, here are some bottles and here is uh, for the camera and here are um, some spools, thread spools and uh, for needles like so and this is uh, all stamps from Tim Holtz and uh, this can also be held uh, needles and some laces and so and some uh, bits and pieces, old screws and clock parts and yeah it's fun to use and here is um, um, I'm not sure what this is called uh, hanging closure <laughs> and uh, a wish ticket, a little bottle here with Discover, and some wish bones and uh, knee, no, <laughs> a key. So I'm just put in different fun things here. So and this is also new from Tim Holtz. Uh, now I forgot the name on this also, but this is uh, you can write something inside here and a little. Was a film strip inside here. Huh. I think I glued it down. <laughs> ah, it's buttons inside here. So, and here I have some twine and a globe that I got from Linda. So thank you so much, Linda. And this. And uh, in the middle here, I have a little notebook. So, like so. Opens with this booklet here. Oh, and yeah, and this is also a, a keyhole die from Tim Holtz. And here I also used uh, packaging paper on the outside, and this was really easy and fast to make. So, and I used old uh, packaging uh, paper inside here, so I can do some journaling. And um, the way I bounded it, I used some hair clips here. So if I need to change uh, the papers here, I can just uh, pull out this and take in some new papers. So this could be uh, fun to use for albums or journaling books or anything. And then you can take one on the top and one on the bottom. So that was that one. And an old key here. Rusty. Now I remember the name. <laughs> it's uh, Rusty. For the other things I showed you. So. so that was that I think and uh, then I will show you uh, the other drawers in uh, the next two videos. So thank you so much for watching and I wish you all a happy and a great day. Take care. Bye bye.